Okay, this video is going to take a look at adding multiple choice questions to a form. So I'm going back to the form that I started earlier. I'm going to click Add a Question, and you notice here that I have a multiple choice option. I will say up front that multiple choice and quiz are very similar, but quiz will allow you to select the right answer and auto grade for you. So for those of you that are working on this for a quiz, this is a great option. If you're filling out a parent survey or a student survey or something like that, multiple choice may be all you need. But for this one, we're going to focus on the multiple choice and multiple select that are both found within this choice option. So I click on that. I can enter my question. If I wanted to add an image, I could come over here. I could search for, and I can go ahead and make sure that's checkmarked and say add. And here you'll see my question or my image is built into my question. I also had the option at that point, if I wanted to, to upload from OneDrive or from my computer. Now at this point, I cannot yet add images to my answer choices, but that is a feature set that I believe is coming based on uh, feedback from other forums and things that I've seen. So here I can select my or put in my answer choices, and when I need to add another option, I just click Add an Option, and I can do that as many times as I want. If I wanted to put another option so somebody could put in a write-in answer, I can just say Add Other Option, and it's going to give them that space where they can go ahead and add uh, text in to put in something else other than what they see listed there. Now let's take a quick look at what this question would look like. So here you see the question is listed. What color is the sky on a sunny day? We've got our image attached, and here now they have the options to do things, and if they wanted to write in black or something like that, they could do that. Now at that point they can submit, and after they've submitted it, you'll be able to see the answer responses right here within the Responses tab, right next to the Questions tab, and you can see here again uh, the feedback for that question based on whatever question type it was. We're also going to go back here and look real quick at this question option because there is that ability to go ahead and do multiple answers or multiple select. And so that would be done with this uh, toggle switch right here. I would just click that on, and now they could select more than one answer. If I do that, I might also want to go ahead and add a subtitle, allowing them or alerting them to the fact that they would need to uh, select more than one option potentially. So if I do that, now I get this option for enter a subtitle, and I can type in something like choose all that apply. I can make this question required. And if I wanted to, I could also shuffle the options so that different people uh, would see different the answer choices in different orders. I'm going to take one last preview here of this one. And now you see the option with the subtitle where it says choose all that apply. And you'll see that I can now select as many answers as I wanted to. So that's how you create a multiple choice question or a multiple select question in Microsoft Forms. Hope this was helpful.